You're watching Sea Dogs TV. We have been and forever shall be committed to the highest standards and a standard of excellence in our organization. And I think today's announcements will show and prove beyond a shadow of a doubt our commitment to that high standard and to excellence. We had an amazing number of applications for this role and that shows a lot of interest for our hockey organization and that, and that certainly says a lot about the caliber of people that applied to all those that that uh, did, thank you, and uh, we're very, very happy with uh, the, uh, the interest that was shown. We can compete with anyone with the right team, and I think today we have the right team. And I want to congratulate the new team that is, is being announced here today for what we expect, a great career with us, uh, a longevity, and a great future for the City of St. John. Thank you very much. I'd like to say a special thank to Thank you to my gentleman on my right, Mr. Norm Gosselin. Norm has been with this organization since day one. Uh, he has um, shown exemplary leadership in terms of his scouting ability and his uh, passion for not only the sport, but for what it means in terms of recruiting and bringing on great character kids to this organization. He has displayed that for the past several years. And we, in fact, are going to elevate him, his role, to a director of player personnel, which shows the confidence that we have in him in terms of helping us even further and being a more active member of our hockey management team. And for the norm, particularly in the last four weeks where it's been trial by fire, while we've tried to go out and uh, search out a great Euro pick, as you know, we have number one and number four Euro picks this year, which are very exciting. And Norm's an, an exemplary job, and thank you, Norm, for that leadership. <laughs> I'll tell you right now, we're very fortunate to name Gerard Glant is the head coach of the St. John Sea Dogs. Well, thanks very much, and uh, as you'll get to know me over the next couple of seasons, I'm not a big speecher, speaker, so what I'm going to try and bring to the hockey club is like Scott talked about. I mean, I'm going to work with 16 to 20-year-old kids for the most part, and I'm going to have a lot of fun with it. I'm going to enjoy it. And we're going to try and develop these kids. I mean, winning is very important, but developing these kids is very important to me. And they're going to have a fun time in St. John. They're going to be an exciting hockey team to watch. I'm, I'm a little bit of old school guy where they're going to compete and they're going to work hard. And they're probably going to be a little bit of a physical hockey team. That's, that's what I like and that's what I like to bring. And, <laughs> and when I say physical, I don't mean a dirty hockey team. I mean, they're going to be physical, fighting for loose pucks. I mean... The old, the old boss people, these games sort of change a lot, but they're going to be ready to play. They're going to come to play, and we're going to have fun with them. And like I said, I'm going to have a lot of fun behind the bench. I, I coach the kids. As, as growing up and being a player, I always thought, talked about, you know, the coach. I want the coach on my side, too. And I'm going to be a coach. When we win, the kids are going to know I'm excited. And when we lose, the kids are going to know I'm a little upset. And they're going to be the same way. So that's, that's my style, and that's the way I'm going to be. I would like to now introduce our associate coach and our director of hockey operations, Mr. Mike Kelly. A thank you to the ownership group to begin with, but I'm absolutely thrilled to have the opportunity to work with both Norm, who I just met, and I have heard a lot of good things about him, and Gerard. I've known and I played against Gerard when we were in junior uh, just a few times, and that was enough. <laughs> but obviously followed his career closely. All Maritimers follow everybody closely uh, through their careers and keep a close eye on them. But the one thing that's been consistent about Gerard has been his integrity. What he says is what he means. He doesn't hide behind words. He doesn't hide behind anything. He is who he is. And I've, I've Coached with a few people like that over the years and enjoyed every second of it. This is going to be really good for me and I think it's going to be absolutely uh, fantastic for the Sea Dog organization. And moving forward, having Norm and Gerard and myself work together is important. It's important to, to have a team at the top. It's important to have a team working with the kids that all believe in the same types of things. Scott alluded to some of the, the off-ice things. I think it's important that we remember we are dealing with kids. It is important to show leadership in that, in a lot of different ways, not just on the ice, but 
uh, through their education and how they conduct themselves in the community, uh, so on and so forth. Uh, there are no shortcuts to success and uh, I think I know Gerard and Norm know that and certainly I'm aware of it and uh, we're looking forward to the challenge and um, when does the ice go in, Scott? <laughs> we're going to have lots of fun and uh, we're going to move this franchise forward and we're going to go to a totally different level and uh, the future is bright for the St. John Sea Dogs and our organization. We are 100% committed to St. John. We will be here forever. And uh, I just can't wait uh, to get the ice in also and uh, get things started. Uh, go Sea Dogs, go. Thank you.